WWA superstars Sean Boomer Bratton along with Norm Weimer. And Norm, we've been talking about how the WWA is the destination for anyone involved in professional wrestling. And we are seeing that right now. Two newcomers, Chris Conflict and Crimson. And you can probably guess without me giving you a lot of cues as to uh, which is which here. Drop toe hold by Chris Conflict. Big deep arm drag. Hip toss. Boy, they're not wasting any time, Norm. Nice drop kick. Chris Conflict getting the upper hand early, and I got to give you some background on Crimson because Crimson is actually from around these parts of Northwest Ohio. He has uh, he has uh, wrestled uh, under the name of Conrad Kennedy the Third or CK3, and he uh, he he's a veteran of the ring. He's been all over the world. He's been to Japan. Uh, he's wrestled many parts, but he has just plain flipped out. This is a guy that is just not the same guy that uh, people have seen before. He is just, something has happened to him. We don't know what it is. We don't know why the transformation, but he, he, is, he is just not the same guy that he was. And quite frankly, he's, he's basically teetering on going over the edge. I would say that by looking at him. It, it, it's, he's, he's in a dark place, a dark place in his life. We don't know why, we don't know what has caused it, but he is not the same guy that he has been in the past. And look at that, still, uh, I guess, exhibiting some of that uh, chain wrestling, which is kind of a departure from uh, what you would think, you know, that fast brawling style we thought we were gonna get at the uh, the start of this contest, but Crimson uh, going to work on that arm, and look at that nice flip up and over on that go-behind, and Crimson fires off with that big elbow, off the ropes, duck down, fast action here. Wow, you can hear that impact. Goes for a quick cover. And once again, Crimson rolling out of the ring. So regardless of what, uh, I guess, identity uh, he believes he is, we're still seeing a lot of skill, but also seeing a lot of skill from uh, newcomer Chris Conflict. Yeah, no question about it. Baseball slide blocks. Oh, big forearm shiver right up by our broadcast table. Maybe dangerously close to our broadcast table. Gonna roll Crimson back in. I need to back up out of the way. Oh. Right over the top of us. Sorry about that, Norm. I figured it was better for me to get out of the way. <laughs> You're uh, neither one of us are professional wrestlers, so it's I was a little concerned because if Chris Conflict fell, well, that'd be the end of both of our broadcasting <laughs> careers. It might have been the end of our night. Uh, yeah, exactly. In the very least. Well, you can see with, with, with Crimson, he is uh, he is just in a very dark place. Uh, just uh, you, you just wonder if the lights are on at this point. Not even really sure. Boy, those hard knife edge chops. Now, of course, Conflict is firing back. Be more red on uh, Crimson. Good reversal into the midsection now. Has him cinched. Takes the knee out. Oh my gosh. Strong style wrestling exhibited by Crimson. Oh. And that's enough to put anybody's lights out. Right exactly. to the back of the head. I'm really surprised at this point Crimson didn't go for a cover, but you start to wonder at this point based on you know what you've told me. If he's even interested yeah, in the cover. Is he even interested in the cover? Yeah, is he for, interested more in punishment? He, he is just he just seems to be angry and he just seems to be wanting to take it out on whoever he goes up against. You know, and he gave and us that. That, that just blank stare right in front of us. Exactly, and I know the camera is right on top of this, as is the referee. Choking conflict out right over that bottom rope. <laughs> you wanna be a referee? <laughs> <laughs> Norm, you were sticking your, do you want to touch that? You're sticking your microphone in the mouth of, uh, of Chris Conflict. Very unorthodox. Oh my gosh, huge forearm. Another huge forearm. Crimson is off the ropes. Ducks under, boot to the midsection, has him cinched. Oh. Big net breaker delivered. Now, do you think Crimson's trying to send a message to the rest of the WWA? I think he is. I'm sure a lot of the guys in the locker room watching on the monitors right now are getting that message, Norm. Well, you know, it's one thing about taking on a guy that's talented or big or strong. It's another one to take on a guy who's just playing nuts. And that would describe Crimson. Big, strong, and nuts. Wrap all of that together. And uh, it certainly looks to me like uh, Crimson has been using 
that tape, because he came out with a, a lot of, uh, it looked like electrical tape wrapped up around his hands and his wrists. And it's not uncommon for wrestlers to keep their uh, their wrists taped up, but boy, this is taking it to the extreme, and he's using some of that excess tape to uh, choke out Chris Conflict. Well, he's got to be careful because if you don't put away Chris Conflict when you get a chance, you may not put him away. Exactly. And we've talked about this before, Boomer. It only takes three seconds to lose a match. Oh, my gosh. I don't even know how to call that. Front DDT? I, I don't even know. I mean, we're seeing so much unorthodox uh, wrestling out of uh, Crimson in this match. Well, it's like a Russian leg sweep that, you know, you turn into almost a face buster. Either way, it doesn't sound very fun. No, I would say that Chris Conflict's not having a whole lot of fun tonight. So Conflict doing whatever he can. Fighting from underneath really is not the position to be in. But he gets himself back up. A couple of shots into the middle. Once again, another forearm, and Crimson is right on top of things, able to shut him down before he can get anything going. Big reversal. Ace Crusher, and both wrestlers are down. I'm really wondering I, 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 what, uh, what they have left at this point. I saw one of the WWA officials in back. They asked Crimson where he's from, and he said the broken mirror. Really? I, I, uh, whatever that means. Yeah, I, I don't want to know where that is. I have no intentions to ever visit there. That's a place I've never been and hope I never end up. Both wrestlers are up. What's going to happen here? Oh, my gosh. Well, this has just turned into uh, an all-out brawl. But Chris Conflict, he's still got a lot left. They're just fighting back and forth. And, you know, Crimson's telling him to bring it on. He wants the punishment. He wants to dish it out. He also wants to receive it, it looks like. Big back elbow. Off the ropes. There's a reversal. Conflict is in. Ducks underneath. Off the ropes. That one-legged drop kick goes for a cover. I almost got him. I thought that was going to be it because he really connected up high with that uh, that right leg. Had a lot of power behind it. Chris Conflict's got to be faking. What do I got to do to try to finish off Crimson? This is a brutal match. Now both guys are winning, much like we've talked about before. Uh, you know, with any superstar here in the WWE, it's uh, who can dig into those reserves as they're deep into this match as they're 10 to 12 minutes in. Maybe a Tornado DDT coming up by Chris Conflict. Has him cinched. Crimson holds on. Ducks down. Has him hooked. And there oh it is. Gosh. It's a career killer. Well, that would kill anyone's career. Oh, you've got it. Wow. I really thought that was it. He was deposited head first on that canvas. I wonder how many careers he's killed with that norm. Bring you know, him back I, up. You, you know, I don't, I don't, I, I, I've been told to look for the career killer, and I don't think we've seen it yet. I don't think that's it. I think that was just a reverse neck breaker. Oh, look at that. That's the old fisherman suplex. Had that, but which is a little extra twist. Little jumping action on the part of Chris Conflict. Doesn't hook a leg, though. Only gets two out of that one. But it just goes to show you that a guy who says he's from the broken mirror, has yeah. a finisher called the career killer. Uh, very fitting. Career killer three. And if he's able to move up the ladder here in the WWA, and a lot's going to depend on this match, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of careers he's going to put his sights on. Misses off of that elbow. We've seen so many devastating moves that could really be finishers for a lot of wrestlers. I can't believe these guys are still standing at this point. Norm. I can't either. Boot into the middle. What are we going to see here now? There it is. That's the career killer right there. Has him hooked. And that could very well kill the career of Chris Conflict. Your winner, very impressive in doing so, is Crimson. Look at that face. The face even a mother couldn't love. I've, I've seen in a long time. And, and it's true, it works, yeah. no question. You know, this really is turning out to be like a, you know, the one, uh, once a month destination here for all the wrestling fans, because they're showing, I see a lot of the same faces here, they're coming in. I, I think this is a good thing going. 